just having some silence so I can cut it down. So, we got an A star. A stars are great. Fantastic. Did we level up? We did. We leveled up. Okay, cool. My Yin Mastery. I'm coming invincible after the Okay. I'm guessing Yin is when you're... I guess Yang is when you're transformed and Yin's got to be when you're frantic, right? I can't remember. It's been so long. I bask in the morning warmth of summer sun and head for Hanzo National Academy. People tend to get sluggish as the weather turns warm, but this is the perfect temperature for me. That's because the sunlight is a source of my energy. I'm in such good spirits, I can't seem to keep myself from humming. Did they not decide to upgrade the pictures? I look up and notice I'm already at the school gate. Not the main gate, it's actually a rear gate made specifically for entering the rear. That's for the Tsunobi students. It wouldn't do to make friends with regular students and have them start getting nosy about which class I'm in. For that same reason, the Shinobi student classrooms are kept well outside of the general student body. He he oh God. Hey. I go through this gate only to hear a voice calling me from behind. It's a boy in a baseball uniform, looking very out of breath as he stops. His hair is buzzed short and his face is very tanned. He must be at least six feet tall. He's a tall lad. No doubt he's seriously into sports. He stammers for a moment and winds up not saying anything at all. I don't want to stand by the rear gate forever. Huh? I'm caught off guard. I have no idea how to react. He drops his gaze in a hurry. His poor gaze. Why, what do those gays ever do to him? I can see the neat little wall of hair on the back of his head. At my failure to respond, he turns and runs off like a scared rabbit. I check the cock and see it's time for homeroom to start. I sprint off with the ninja room. The entire morning passes in a blur. No one's ever said anything like that to me before. Hibari peers at my face. Ooh, post. My post has just arrived. How conveniently. How conveniently? How convenient. I suddenly realise it's lunchtime. I'm just sitting here on my lunchbox daydreaming. Everyone in the ninja room reacts as one. So much so they startle me. As they bombard me with questions, I decide to go ahead and fill them in. Ikaruga speaks as with calm assurance. I'm trying to be more like her in that regard. Cat is almost trembling with enthusiasm. Fucking cats are arguing. No, all I want is to be a shinobi. I don't have dreams of becoming a celebrity. Still, in the face of Cat's unbridled excitement, I can't help but give her a wry smile. Nakuriga nogs at Hibari's question. I thought baseball was big in Japan, so surely they'd know this. Surely they would know this. This is like not new information. As usual, Hibari is a little off the mark. But with her, oh god, I missed. I didn't read it in time. Ikuruga asks a question quietly as if to ca calm the turmoil. Yagi keeps her voice quiet and level. It's like she's just splashed my mind with water. 
The ninja room bustling with activity only moments before goes silent. Even Cat Cell was down. I don't have the time to spare for love. I want to be a shinobi and that's all. Really? I don't even know what's going out is or what, how you're supposed to do it. Plus I don't know what kind of person that boy is. He might not be the kind of person I want to be around, let alone fall in love with. Feeling much better, I pop open the lid of my lunchbox. Inside is my favourite futamaki rolls. Oh my god, her favourite. Huff, puff, pan. I carelessly run along the mountain path. Every morning I perform personal training. I'm still inexperienced. I'm nowhere near as strong as Kat is. Hikaru is much faster than I am. Yagu's technical mastery in Hibari's espionage skills are superior to mine as well. Since I'm not a fan of losing to anyone, I'm always training as much as I can. I suddenly sense another presence. The boy from yesterday emerges from the woods. Again, he's wearing his baseball uniform. He shakes his head in a sudden panic. Personal training. Just like me, I think, but I don't say. It's practice more than anyone. I want to tell him I know how that feels. I see the glance at his face. Even though he's drenched in sweat, he still looks full of energy. He's actually kind of cool. I feel myself begin to blush and quickly look away. I have to admit, I'm being a little mean. Suzuki quickly wipes his palms. I smile at him and he lets out a huge sigh. I lose all my words and fall utterly silent. All I can hear are the birds in the wind. Suzuki smiles bitterly and scratches his head. I find myself looking straight into his eyes. His pure, honest eyes. Would it be okay to see his game? Hikaru and Yagi wouldn't be too upset about it, I wouldn't think. I realise I'm still hesitating. Suzuki lowers his head slightly and starts jogging down the mountain. His back is broad and manly. Okay. Is this, is this an entire arc of this game? Right as morning classes end, the door to the ninja room yeah! flies open. <laughs> the sushi chef bursts in, laughing loudly. It's my very dear grandpa, Hanzo. Chicha? <laughs> My grandpa's known as the legendary shinobi. Before he retired, he was apparently amazing. Rumor has it that the Hanzo Academy is actually named after him. I mean, his name is the Hanzo fucking Academy. His name is Hanzo. What are you expecting at this point? And that's a good thing. We protect others from the shadows. And we do it with no expectation of gratitude. I think that's what the battle for justice is all about. I'd love to be a shinobi of grandpa's caliber. That's been my dream since I was little. At that, he entices a cloth wrapper. The smell of rice vinegar greets our senses. If Barry literally jump, literally, lit, liter, oh my god, words are fucking difficult. Literally jumps for joy. Everyone quickly gathers around there. My parents run a sushi restaurant. 
It's managed by both of them plus Grandpa. Business is tough, but the regular customers make up for it. I take the sushi bucket from him and go around, handing the rolls out to everyone. It's thick fried pat <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, it's not even fucking like. Oh. Jesus. As everyone cheerfully stuffs food tamaki rolls into their mouths, Grandpa smiles and motions me over. Did the others tell him? No, they wouldn't have just blurted this out. So how do they know about the boy? After thinking about it, it hits me. Grandpa's a legendary sh shinobi. No one can hide secrets from him, especially not his own granddaughter. I shake my head. He lowers his voice to a whisper and tells me the story. Dad was a law student at a famous university. Apparently, he fell in love with my shinobi student mum at first sight. Grandpa objected to them dating, of course. But Dad refused to give up and got into an endless series of arguments with Grandpa in the process. じいちゃんはどうして弟さんとお母さんの仲を許したの？お前のお父さんは弁護士の夢を捨て、わしと一緒に寿司屋をやると言い出したんだ。愛する人と添い遂げるためなら夢も金も地位もいらない。お前のお
He'd been his team's sword and shield all rolled into one. I smiled softly and gently closed the paper. What a lovely end to that story. I guess. I'm going to quickly go see what Ash got to live with. Give me one second. It was but a letter, and it was not for me. God damn it. What a waste of my time. Oh no, Asuka's lost her wallet. Whatever should we do? She could well be Asuka. You had the equivalent of five pounds in there. Beautiful. You only get five pounds allowance? That's pretty poor for a girl who's like, what, 16? 17? Maybe 18? I don't know the fucking ages. Of age, or whatever. I don't know how old she is. I don't even want to look it up, because every time you look it up, it's bad. In this game, she is unaged. Okay. What's okay. okay. in the box? There you go, top secret file, first thing. I did it. That thing down there. Damn me. Okay, okay, damn it. I don't know what it is. My curiosity. Okay. Nothing that one. Oh my god, leave me alone. Yeah. Alright, fine. I don't have enough to transform that. It didn't mean it would take longer to transform that. Fuck you guys. Oh, I can transform that. Alright, sweet. I can transform. That's good. Here we go. It's all about that Shinobi transformation. Let's fuck you up. At least I've added some more moves because I don't remember that like spinning one at all. Come on, come on, me. Yeah, have that one. Fuck you. Down here then. What are you? Oh shit. Oh god. Oh shit. Oh my days. Was I not my... Are you a mega baddie? That's right. You must be a mega baddie. Like this mythical thing. Fucking you like... Oh Jesus Christ. Okay, he does a fucking lot of damage. Fuck you! Oh, my oh, oh shit! Oh my days! Fucking hell! 
This is ridiculous. Oh my god. Okay, right. Okay, yep. Bye. Fuck you. Alright, don't need this shit. You really fucking kill me. Can I get out of it? Okay, I can. What in the fuck? What the actual fuck? I have no idea what that was. But he was way too strong for me. He was like, just... Fuck me. Oh, I lose. Well then. That was just fantastic. Yeah, I failed, I know. Great. Can I retry? I can now block and carry me there. Fantastic. Can I retry, please? Ugh. That was dumb. It's all because of that fucking random boss thing that I saw. Like, Jesus. Shouldn't have gone after him yet. I'm clearly not good enough for the game for this yet. Plus, I think if, if they're still leveling up the characters, I will clearly have a lot more health by the time I'll be able to fight that guy. That's why I also don't take a hit for no fucking reason here. God, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Fuck you. But also, screw you guys. Don't need your shit. Don't need your shit whatsoever. Is that them gone? Oh, there's one there. Hang on. I wonder. How do I. Because there's a way to move underground with that, I think. It must be. I, I, I can't see the way to do it. I'm not going to go fight that bastard again. At least not yet. He is way too powerful. Come on, hit me. I was gonna try and parry, but fucked it. But it didn't work. Yes, leveled up. Sweet. Three upgrades. I don't know what the fuck that is. It hasn't. Oh, fuck. At least when I level up, I can just straight up transform. There's a positive. There's a positive for ya. Now let's keep the shit out of them. By the way, she's so much faster when she levels up. Well, not levels up, but that's fine. And hit combo, perfect. All good. Do I, I wonder, do I have the... No, I don't yet. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Get in boxes for now. I want to be left alone. Alright, fuck you then. If you won't leave me alone. Let's remove, let's remove the um, like big old animation. Or, uh, little bit. How are you still alive? Oh, she's still not gone. Down yet? There we go, now she's down. We done did it! We hot god dang done did it! Awesome. Fantastic.
Here I go, Jugs. Time to kick the shit out of Homera. Time to kick the shit out of Homera. Homera, 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 Homera. No, I'm guessing I'm not kicking the shower yet. Those moves, the barely animated moves when she got my wallet back were fantastic. Yeah. Wait, up at least. That's always good. Cool. Yeah. Let me uh let me go back to the thing and see what we can do with these upgrade things. Because there's gotta be something. There can't be nothing. Um maybe dressing room. Can I see here? Visuals, music, voices, videos. Seems fast. Okay. Uh, shop? Regular products. We don't want to go to the places. Oh, it's all outfits, accessories. That's all. Eat your food to market rolls. Okay. That's fine. School select something that's between. Yeah, that's what I do. Uh, that would be. You won't be in here, right? Oh, I'm really fucking confused. Yeah, oops, wrong room. Oh, there's those different fucking outfits. I can put her in Hikage's outfit. Oh, day. I've got two trophies. That's, that's all I wanted. Oh, hang on. Did I just... Hang on. Wait a second. What the fuck did I just change? Okay, cool. Oh, I can change the transformation shit as well. That's interesting. Okay. Alright, that's fine. So what were those fucking upgrades? Were they just general upgrades? I don't... Did I miss out on something? Confirm ability. Take this. Uh, okay. Alright. Ah, so every time I get a level, you unlock new shit. Right. Okay, that's interesting. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That'll make sense to me now. Sure, that's fine. Once again, if you're on YouTube, bye for now. Uh, let's continue on. 